RC. Today we're taking the, D the GTV up in the air again. It's been, I don't even know how long, I'll have to look, uh, probably a month or two, I don't know. It's been quite some time. Um, we broke the motor mount on the last flight, I think because the prop ended up hitting the ground and ripped the motor off. So we're still running the same prop, but I did trim about a half an inch off each end. So instead of being a seven inch, it's more like a six inch prop now. Um, but this is a, uh, or was a seven by four. Um, basically a six by four now. Um, so that when we land or when we take off, hopefully the prop doesn't hit the ground anymore. Should have plenty of clearance. Um, but otherwise, um, it should fly amazing. There's no safe or anything on this. Um, we have just a little bit of tuning. Um, I think we, yeah, we have a high, a high medium and low rates. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and fly it in, in high rates and We'll just chuck it up in the air and have a little fun with it. It's been so long since I've flown it. Um, let's get it up in the air. so tiny and quiet. Go ahead and do a little spinning on it. So we're flying at about 65% throttle. And just kind of based on our last couple of flights, we should have uh, at least 10, 10 minutes of fly time go for quite some time. Get this thing a little lower and get a nice little pass. And this thing just does really good. I think the last time we flew it, uh, Mason flew it, I think, right? Uh, Did yeah. you fly this last time? Yeah. That's, for sure. uh, I think that's when Mason was flying for a little while and and uh, did like a roll and ended up rolling directly into the ground, yeah. which is totally fine. <laughs> we're, we're always having fun. I can't remember if we did rolls with this thing or not. Um, let's see. Oh yeah. Let's see here. Yeah, roll right's not too bad. How's it glide? So let's go ahead and do some gliding. Let's uh, hit full throttle here and just, uh, it just doesn't have a ton of power, so I'm going to take a second to get gain some altitude. Um, we'll get it up there a little ways. Okay, we'll go ahead and kill the power. And then start gliding. Where is it? We have like no wind today. I feel like if we had some wind, it might actually help because then we could fly into the wind. But look at that, it's doing it. It stays up pretty well. This thing does have a 60 inch wingspan. Um, it's got a small cord. Uh, I think the cord's only five inches, but still, uh, it's got a lot of wing, so, and it's super light. Um, so, it actually glides pretty well. Let's go ahead and stand over here in the shade so we can see a little better. Yeah, there were some birds up there that were flying really close to it. This thing flies really well. I kind of forgot how well it flies. That nice flyby. And it's nearly silent. Yeah, this thing does great. Um, 
I'll see if I can uh, bring a bias and we're flying like 65% throttle or so. See if we can do like a full speed pass. Not that it's fast or anything, but still fun. Yeah, it does pretty good. How fast do you think it's going? At least like 20. I bet you this thing is doing... Uh, like 30? Like 30. 35. It's pretty quick. Yeah, it's totally fine. It's exactly, it's exactly what I want it to be. It is slow and efficient. I just want this, uh, the whole reason I built this plane is to have something that I could just fly for quite a while on low throttle and um, get some decent fly time out of. Just, just an easy, slow, chill flyer that I can maybe do some rolls in and otherwise just have some nice relaxing flying. Um, and it handles really well. It does great. This thing is just, it's kind of a joy to fly because it's so easy. Um, and it's got some decent uh, dihedral and um, while flying the, the wings do bend a little bit more and it just kind of increases the stability. It just flies great. We don't have any wind today, which is ideal for this tiny little plane. Um, but man, it just does good. Really couldn't ask for more. It's such a cool, tiny little plane. Let's see if I can come up, uh, remeasure everything on this, because you know all my planes are kind of made up on the spot. I just come up with something in my head and I build it, and nine times out of ten it works out great. Uh, this one we did have to uh, change the fuselage a little bit, shorten it up a little bit to get a proper CG. But now that this thing flies great. Um, See if I can get some measurements and, and come up with some plans for this because I think this will be an amazing beginner plane. It just handles so nicely. It's so chill to fly. And this is, I mean, you could totally put safe in this if you wanted to, but um, as long as it's tuned properly, it just doesn't need it. Um, you can set your rates and um, expo and it could be super easy to fly. How much do we have on the timer? Or how many um, minutes left? I have two timers on here. One for 8 minutes and one for 15. Um, so we might we might, uh, we might fly for a few more minutes. Okay. Let's see if I could do uh, another pass bias here. Okay, ready? How close can you get it? Oh, I'll get it a little closer. I'll do a nice close flyby. This thing, it just floats. It just does so well. Really, really couldn't ask for more. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. That was a good shot. And we'll try that. We'll try that again. It's time. Let's see if we get a nice fly by. Yeah. This thing is just wonderful to fly. It's so chill. I just love it. This is so unlike most of the planes that I've built. A lot of my planes are pretty pretty quick, um, or they're just really big. Um, this thing, oh, <clears throat> looks like right close to the end of my timer there. Battery one went a little low, so let's go pick it up. So um, I'll have to re rechange my my timer now. I'll have to lower it. I guess we did a few uh, speed passes there wore out the battery a little quicker than I had hoped, but that's okay. I'm sure it landed gracefully in the in the tall grass. Have but, anything um, else to say? Uh, I just love this little plane. It's great. Hopefully I didn't break it. I think it probably landed nice and softly in the grass over here. And we'll get it up again soon and do another video for you guys. But let me know what you think of this awesome little plane.